Hello students, Rupal ma'am is back with um, answers of chapter 2 and 3. Hope you have completed them and please be ready as usual with your notebooks, also the textbooks, pencil and pens, whatever you are writing with. Let us quickly begin with the answers. The first exercise is of nouns like I told you, I had already probably even made you underline the proper common collective abstract and material nouns here i have written there is not much place to write the common nouns but i have still tried to fit them here so that is not much then you have again exercise 2 where you will write what are countable and what are uncountable nouns then you have exercise 3. This is the column, a bag of potato wafers. That is number F. I hope you have understood that this is not really difficult. Exercise 4, please note, will come after I finish chapter 2 and 3. It will come last. Exercise 4 will come last. I have changed the whole sentence from singular to plural. At the end of this video, the last exercise which is handwritten by me is exercise 4. Please take note of that. Here we have exercise 5 also where you are supposed to write the collective nouns. Then we have exercise 6 where we write the abstract nouns. Exercise 7, again the abstract nouns. The third one is expertise. There was not much place. It is expertise, T-I-S-E. And the fourth is unpopularity. Unpopularity. I hope you can understand. Exercise 8 was just for fun, but still I've solved it for you if you have done it. Then we have exercise 9 here where you have to fill in the blanks and make abstract nouns. Then we have pronouns. Here also we have exercise 1. You just fill in the simple pronouns. Same with exercise 2 where we have reflexive and emphasizing pronouns also to be filled up. Exercise 3 where you had to just tick the demonstrative pronouns and the fill in the blanks also. <coughs> then we have exercise 6 where you fill up the interrogative pronouns. Exercise 7, relative pronouns are filled up for you. Exercise 8, you were supposed to join the sentences. Okay, since I have not written this, I will just say it. Please pay attention. I am saying the whole sentence. Number 2, we got into a bus which was full of passengers. Number three, I saw a juggler who was showing his tricks. Number four, here is a book which you lost yesterday. Which you lost yesterday. Here is a pen you were looking for. Number six, my brother whom I loved is dead. My brother whom I loved is dead. Number seven, these are the boys whose parents are here. Number eight, that is the man whom we saw yesterday. Number nine, the boy who tells lies deserves to be punished. Number ten, look at these boys. Who are singing. I hope you got the answers. 
of exercise 8. Now we have exercise 9. Again that is very simple. You just had to fill it up with the correct pronouns. It's easily visible also so sh there should not be any problem here. The last like I told you is exercise 4 of nouns where I converted the sentences from singular to plural. So here all the sentences are written for you. Please make, take a note of this. So I hope till lesson 3 you have all your answers and you are completely clear with the sentence nouns and pronouns. See to it that at least now your books are completed and you are thorough with the first three chapters so we can quickly proceed with the fourth chapter that is adjectives. But that is all for now. Bye. See you.